Good Sunday, everyone. I'm meteorologist Sam Samperi. A beautiful, spectacular day again today, much like yesterday, except a couple degrees warmer, dry and mild for your Halloween. Warm this week. There could be some showers Monday night into Tuesday, but not a big deal. Basically, we have high pressure in control, and that high is, gave us the clear chilly conditions, freezing and frosty conditions on your Sunday morning. But with high pressure in control, it is going to give us a beautiful Sunday. This is our next uh, weather maker. Low pressure coming out of Texas, moving up into, oh, it looks like we're going into Missouri and up towards Illinois. But it's going to kind of shift a little bit east and break apart as it moves in our direction for Monday night into Tuesday. We'll get the warm front and then the cold front combination. So we put the map into motion. We start out for your Monday morning. We're fine. Clear to partly cloudy and some clouds increase. And by the time we get to about 10, 11 o'clock, the warm front will crash through the region with some showers. It'll be right after Halloween trick-or-treaters during the evening hours. That's good news. And then the cold front moves in with a couple of showers. These showers might be a little bit overdone. That's the European model. It always is overdone. Uh, seems like lately with high pressure in control for uh, Wednesday into Thursday and Friday too as well. It's going to be beautiful this week. First few days of November is going to feel like the first week of May. So bright and sunny for your Sunday. High temperatures reaching 60 to 65 with a light and variable wind tonight becoming partly to mostly cloudy with lows down in the 40s. For tomorrow, uh, look for a mix of sun and clouds with highs again in the mid 60s. It'll be dry and mild. Uh, during the day. And as we put this into motion, I'm starting the clock at 4.30 tomorrow. I mean, for the trick-or-treaters, you can see that it's dry across the area, even sunshine. And then the clouds roll in, and it looks like we're going to get some light showers rolling in around 10 to 11 o'clock after trick-or-treating. And then we get a band of rain. It could give us a good quarter inch, maybe a little bit more. And then a couple of showers rolling in on Tuesday. And then the cold front comes in Tuesday evening, and that sets the stage for a bright, beautiful middle and end of the week. So your Halloween activities, I'll step out of the way. For all the trick-or-treaters, enjoy. It's a warm treat for the time of year with temperatures between 55 and 60 under partly cloudy skies. Of course, the sun goes down at 545 tomorrow evening, and then they'll scatter showers for Tuesday. But again, not a big deal. So the good news is trick-or-treaters, you're going to have a nice Halloween. Here's your Fox 61 seven-day forecast showing you basically we're going to have temperatures getting up between 65 and 70 from Tuesday through next Saturday. Hard to believe that it's the first few days of November. On that note, have a safe week and enjoy Halloween, kids, and see you next week. I'm meteorologist Sam Samperi.